first thing you notice is the massive Greek god outside the building. Our specialty is making really cool big things. And once you get past Poseidon, those cool big things just keep coming. We do everything from tall Anubises to rock walls to four foot tall gummy bears to four foot tall letters. All this and more comes from a little place called VFX Foam. The letters stand for visual effects. Yep, so it's an acronym used in the industry a lot for um, concept designing. The company launched in mid-2016, and it's quickly growing a reputation as a place that can build anything from plain white styrofoam. So it starts off with these eight foot four by four chunks, and then we'll take this and move it over to the hot wire cutter. And the hot wire cutter has a hot wire that extends from one side to another. Then the foam goes into a CNC machine, a computerized cutter that carves out more detail. It's all a collision of creativity and computation. You don't think you're going to use, like, trigonometry? Well... These foam figures of the Egyptian god Anubis will end up in an escape room on the East Coast, a game where people decode clues in order to find their way through a life-sized maze. So this is the foam when it would come off the mill after it got shaped and carved, and then the sculptors would mold it even more. After they're carved, the figures get coated with the same material you find in truck bed liners. It's hard. It's not going to go anywhere. This stuff's so tough, you can play on it. So these are our slides we build for uh, water parks, and they're all made out of foam. VFX truly can make anything. Mayan ruin? Check. Alien head? Yep. Fake weapons of mass destruction? The grenade. Found them in Ferndale. And here's another cool thing. They recycle this stuff. The styrofoam waste gets melted down into hard plastic blobs and made into things like CD cases. VFX has an unofficial motto. Bigger the better. It applies to both what they make and their plans to quadruple in size in the next few years to keep up with the demand for fun stuff made from foam. The whole team here is really talented at what they do and they all specialize in different things, but in the end it creates this amazing piece. So if you're in the market for a massive deity or anything that's large and light, consider your problem solved. Exactly. There's nothing we can't do. All right, that big carving machine in the story was actually making this wow. for us. It is we got so one too. Cool. What does this one say? It took 11 hours, by the oh, way. We got it backwards. Oh, it like this. backwards. Wow. 11 hours, yeah. That's amazing. These could be collector's items yes. because they're working with Disney now, so it could be a big oh, deal. Yes.